G'day gamers, welcome to New by Design. Gonna be doing a video here on Spider-Man, and I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to easily beat Shockwave in the main storyline, Financial Shock. Alright gamers, so the Shockwave fight is gonna be broken up into three different phases, with the first phase essentially having him shoot three beams of Shockwave directly at you, then he'll jump with a smash attack, and then depending how far you are away when that happens, he'll either slide over to you or just in place like he did right there, do this kind of Shockwave tornado attack, go down on his knee and open himself up for some damage. To do the damage though, you are actually gonna have to go ahead and grab onto something and throw it at him, otherwise you can't actually damage him. Most important thing about this fight is the timing of avoiding that shockwave that he's doing right now and essentially the portion that you're looking for is when he brings his arms up to the side and kind of like he's flexing both of his biceps there his arms go up to his side that's when you're going to want to hit that O button to dodge making sure that you're dodging side to side not front to back because then you'll still be in the same line and take the hit and then you are going to go ahead and make sure that you avoid it as you can see I'm doing here works every time as soon as his arms go up hit that O button side to side and you will avoid the damage then just kind of jump around and you'll be able to avoid the smash and the shockwave tornado hit l1 r1 to grab onto something and then you're gonna have to go ahead and throw it at him before he'll be opened up to damage and then essentially you just hit triangle to go ahead and smash towards him and continue the attack again you're gonna have to do that three times for the first phase and once you get all three of those done then you're gonna move on towards the second phase which is a little bit different however it does still follow the same start protocol here where you have the three shockwave beams that shoot at you once you get the three shockwave beams he'll jump either once or twice that's kind of random to do a smash attack and then he'll do his big aoe or cone like damage attack which is when he is open to have something thrown at him here you're gonna have to pick something up with l1 r1 throw it at him and then he's open up for that damage as you can see we'll do right here right now we'll hit triangle to pull ourselves towards him do the damage cycle and then we'll have to rinse and repeat that method three times again you can still use that dodge when he flexes up at his side to avoid it but for this one because that cone like aoe damage and his jump it is just significantly easier to be in the air swinging around him in a circular pattern to avoid the damage because then you don't take any of the AoE damage from the ground hits and you find yourself in a position behind him generally speaking where you can throw something at him and open him up for that damage as you can see again here we're gonna go ahead and make sure we smash him and do the damage you did notice there at one point I actually did take a hit and the reason for that is because when I was swinging on my web I wasn't going side to side I ended up going front to back but either way, we've made it to phase three, which will have shockwave shooting for laser beams or shockwave beams at you. And the easiest way to dodge them is by going around in a circle while swinging on your web. Once you do that, eventually after the four go down, you'll see that he goes to his knee. And the only way to up him up to the next section is to go ahead and aim at one of those pillars grab it with the r1 l1 button smash that square button as fast as you can and it will break it you'll have to do that twice and then as you can see right here it will go ahead and drop down on him ruining his shockwave suit and ending this boss fight you know gamers if you guys found this video useful at all i sure would appreciate if you guys had hit that like button and if you guys are struggling with anything in spider-man or you just can't find anything in the game go ahead and hit me up with a comment in the comments below i'll see if i can hook you up with a video to help you out Alright gamers, thanks for watching.